Hi everyone, I would like to show you a non-typical blacktail deer and a monster blacktail deer. Hope you enjoy. Alright, first up is a dead non-typical blacktail. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's the only footage I had out of it because I just started the recording. As soon as I saw it was non-typical, I got the recording footage up and just decided to shoot it there before anyone else ran over because there was another person that just randomly joined and was starting to run over towards me so I wasn't sure if he was going to take the kill or not because I did want footage of it after all. So here it is dead here. Now there's another person that I was hunting with, King of Canada, who's actually up top a bit just up there so he'll run over and have a look at a non-typical that I killed here because he's never seen one before So he'll run over shortly and be in the trophy shop with me for this one. But here it is here. Very nice. But as you saw, the, the score bugged out. I actually got zero score for this. So unfortunately, it doesn't go on the leaderboard or anything like that. But here's the trophy shot anyway. But yeah, there's that guy running over towards me. I'm just seeing where he is. I'm telling him to please go away, but he doesn't seem to be listening. But anyway, there's King of Canada, just there. Um, I'm, a, I'm on the mic with him at the moment, so I'm trying to get him in a good position quickly before the other bloke comes running over into the trophy shot too. It's a very nice non-typical though, I think it could have scored at least in the hundreds. It's a real shame that it bugged out on me, but oh well, I got a really nice trophy shot on it though. There we go. And of course, that leaves us the monster blacktail. Here it is here. So its score range is 180 to 200, that's because I've got max spotting skill though. If I didn't have max, max spotting skill, it would probably be maybe 160 to 200 or so. But that's just a guess. Um, but here it is coming in. It's good to know just the difference between the monster blacktail and a non-typical. Obviously the non-typicals have a more like a lightning bolt sort of zigzaggy pattern to them. Whereas the, the monster black tails, this one here, has a more square, like, wide rack to it. It doesn't have any weird sort of thunderbolt pattern going on. Looks even either side too is another good way to tell. In the trapper clothing, I'll take it out of the heavy recurve though. There we go. Guys, we won't worry about the dough, just run over and collect it. There we go. And he scores 193.696. Very nice. And here's the trophy shot. Now, I snuck in a little bit extra of a surprise here. Unfortunately, my character has a bit of the sniffles at the moment. I'm not sure why. I'm pretty sure, though, it's because I spawned in at a normal tent. I don't think I spawned in at a heated tent, so therefore I automatically had the cold, even though I have a full set of Arctic clothing on. So, yep, I'm just taking off the scope of the premium 4570 here. I'm going to be shooting this moose with the open sights of the gun. Here she is there. As you can tell, yes, she is piebald. So let's see if we can get a nice clean shot on her. Just bring out the 4570 for you to have a look at. 
This is a premium one. Looks quite nice. I do like the engraving on it. I'm just not a fan of the actual wood on it. It, it kind of looks a bit plasticky, I think. But oh well, that's just my personal opinion on it. But here we go. She's stopped just there, so this will be a nice broadside shot. Here we go. And of course, she drops nice and clean. There's a reload in open sights. So of course, she will score zero, but it's a rare, and that's all that matters. Would have been nice if it was a male though, but oh well. Here's the trophy shot I ended up with. I think it looks quite nice. That's it for this video. Remember, if you want to see more content from me, you can always check out my Twitch channel. The link is in the description below. And as always, Thanks for watching.